from genetic emphysema will have their medication fully withdrawn by the end of the week. It follows a decision by the HSE not to reimburse them for the drug Respreza, saying the costs outweigh its benefits. Some patients who've been on the drug for over a decade say the treatment has given them a good quality of life and are now fearful of what will happen. Alpha 1 patient Orla Keane receiving her medication for the last time after 12 years. She, along with 20 other patients, have been receiving the drug Respreza on a compassionate use basis from the drug company following a trial. However, it's now being withdrawn after a HSE decision not to fund it. We've had this for so long, right? We're going to miss it. Really, really miss it. I mean, I don't know. Next week, you don't store it in your body. That's why you've had it every seven days. So after seven days, next week, what's going to happen? Before taking the medication, Orla suffered severe choking and coughing fits and is fearful that her symptoms will now return. But the feeling of the HSE was that the benefits of the medication were modest and didn't justify the cost. My concern, absolutely. It's for 17 uh, patients in this jurisdiction, 21 patients on the island of Ireland. I would, though, as you have, suggest that the company should come forward with more information. The company should reflect on the price they're seeking in this jurisdiction. In a statement, drug company CSL Bayering said it had continued to support the programme and extended it several times as they awaited a decision from the HSC. The company insists that studies show that patients demonstrated a consistent pattern of slower lung density decline than those receiving a placebo and is deeply disappointed that Respreza will not be reimbursed. There's never been a situation where people have been on Alpha 1 replacement therapy for in excess of 10 years uh, has suddenly stopped. I think it's incumbent upon the company to at least meet our government halfway, but it's equally incumbent on our government to go back to the negotiation table. But Orla says that she and the other patients taking the drug are proof that it works and are calling on the HSE to reconsider. I'm healthy. I'm very, very healthy. I'm symptom free. I can't help all the other patients that we've got a genetic disease. It's not our fault. But we need this drug to continue on. You know, I mean, if, we, if they take it away, we're finished. It's now a waiting game for Orla and the other patients in terms of what effect being left without their treatment will have. And I'm asking the government, I'm asking the, the whole of Ireland, save our lungs, save us. We're faint. <laughs> Niamh Kinsella, 3 News. The fallout from the flight cancellation fiasco in Ryanair continues this lunchtime.